What's up, everybody? Easy Cool Gaming back with a Dead by Daylight tier list. You know, we're going to be rating how easy and how hard the play well, the killers are to play as. Alright, well, enough said, let's get right into it. I didn't say much. <laughs> Alright, first of all, because this is not in any order, well, no, this is in order, how hard and hard it is, how hard and easy it is to play as each killer. Now, first, we've got what the artist, the artist, the artist. The artist, I like her, she's as a killer, but. She only has a crows. Yeah, but if you, know, you, can, you can get them lined up, lined up straight, and you can use them very well, like for people that are looping you. I say easy. You just need to get them all lined up, and you can spread them all across the map. You know, I did a full tier list video before, very controversial. In my opinion, I explained lots more. But you can use them all the way across the map. All right, next up is the Bly. Now, straight away, it's hard, super hard. You know, he's got his like, speed ability. You know, if you get really good with him, you can just dominate a whole team. Dominate a whole team. But I am not that good. Um, And personal opinion, you know, you can't control them very well for, like, new players. I put them hard. Super hard. Super hard. Next up is a Bubba. You know, Bubba, pretty good. Very good starter. You know, one of the best perks in the game, barbecue and chili and all that. Also, I like Franklin's Demise, you know. Maybe I should do a perk tier list. Um... But I think super easy, you know, he's got the chainsaw and the M1. That's it, I think. The chainsaw, that's decently easy to use. Apart from that, very easy. <laughs> Next up, the clown. Ooh, wow, so scary. <laughs> but I think he's medium. You know, you might say, oh, he's easy. But you need to be good with throwing all of his bottles in all the right directions. You know, throwing them right at the person, using your yellow bottles perfectly. And for that reason, I would say medium, you know. But apart from that, he would be an easy, but medium. You just need to be good with aiming your bottles and using your yellow bottles. Okay, next up, the Death Slinger. Now, he's basically a, like a Call of Duty person with a sniper, a no scope. You know, but you've only got one shot, you have to reel it all in. I think he might just have a buff, but apart from that, I'd say medium, because you just need to reel it all in. Like, it seems easy enough, except he's also very slow. Next up is the Demogorgon. Oh, wow. He's a good killer, you know. I just finished watching a season for Volume 2 of Stranger Things. Oh, my gosh. I still want more, but let's get right into it. Um, I think he's a medium. Medium. Oh, medium because of all his portals and his other... It's the one where he just dashes forward. I think medium. Couldn't say really hard, but yeah. All right. Next up is the Doctor. Now, this is going to be... Decently controversial, but if he's actually, I think he's fairly easy to use once you get good with him. You just need to zap the floor, zap him, you know, he's got really good perks. Easy. I mean, that's like, why isn't he in medium? It's because you can just zap him and zap him and just find the location and just trigger them. Like, it's great, he's great, but also very hard. Well, no, not too hard. Once you get it all right and you get a small map, he's perfect. Next up is the Dredge. Dredge, no skill in the game. But, you know, his locker, very easy cross-country, cross-map, basically. You know, his M1, the Nightfall, that's just great. You know, great, you know, you can activate it faster, that would be perfect. Super easy, it does it basically for you. Okay, the Executioner is next. Ooh la la la. He's good and he would be easy because he's got his big sword, well, big knife thingy. Yeah, but his... What's it called? Trail of Torment and all that. I don't, I, is that the perk? I'm not sure. It's just goes in a straight line. It goes long, but if someone knows what you're doing, you know, he's hard. I mean, my maybe medium, but hard, hard. Next up, Ghostface. Now, people might say, oh, he's super easy. But personal opinion, he's just an easy because people, I've seen people that just don't go on to Night Shroud and you don't stalk them. They just stalk people that are already injured, like, all the way. So, easy. So, you need to Please have some common sense with them. Okay, next up, the hag. The hag, the hag, the hag. Now, now I did put her in D tier in my last video, but someone commented, so go look at her, all that, play as her. I mean, I didn't really end up getting to play with her much, but her perks, she's got two of the best perks in the game, personal opinion. So she's definitely higher than D tier in my last video, but I'd say she's easy, getting all the traps and all that. So, yeah. Okay, next up, the hillbilly. Ooh la la la. So, if, I've seen some really good people, but sometimes they just don't use this chainsaw. And also, you know, chainsaw is great for getting cross map. But 
you need to be good with not bumping into all stuff and you need a good map. So that's dependent on map. But I'm going to say hard. You know, getting it all straight, getting it all lined up. You could say medium, but I'm just saying hard. Just saying hard. Okay, the Huntress. Ooh, okay, okay. Huntress is a good killer. I think she is very, very good. You know, catch it, you can throw them across the map. But at the same time, you need to be accurate with them. You can't just keep them throwing, throwing, get looped. Like, they hide behind something and they keep them popping out. Making trying to use one, I'd say she's easy. You know, you could say medium or super easy, but I just think middle easy. Okay, next up, the Legion. The Legion, he's great killer, super easy with frenzy. He's super easy. What else do I have to say? You know, you just need to use his um, frenzy mode and just bap, 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 injure everyone. Just keep pressure. Hopefully, get an auto haven map. And boom, you are laughing. He's great, easy, simple. Okay, the Nemesis. Now he's a good killer, zombies. But when I used him, I didn't really get to use his tentacles. The tentacles are his main thing, but I'm just, you know, you know, you have to always pull them out. I mean, I assume, assume it would be very, fairly easy, but I'd say, strong opinion, medium. Medium, you know, you have to use all his tentacles to get them straight. Apart from, oh, he might be easy. I'm just going to say medium for now. I do need to play as him more because I've not played too much of him. Too much of him. But, yeah, okay. Next up is Freddy Krueger. Well, the nightmare. I'd say I've seen him, like, he can teleport with gens now. I've seen him, he was not dead tier. He should be higher than my last video. But I've played some more, watched more of him. And I think he's in a hard kill. You know, oh, but he's easy, you know. But just need to be good with all the dream snares and all that. That's just my personal opinion. My personal opinion. All right, next up. Is the nurse. That's all I've got to say. I get slugged by her. I mean, I've tried playing her, but she's just so hard to use. And I, I can't get anything really great with her. But she's great. If you can just teleport, teleport. Just make sure you don't teleport into the basement. So, that's what I've seen lots of people do. You know, yeah. She's a great killer, though. I should have watched more. should put her in S in my last video. Okay, next up is the Pinhead from Hellrise. Super hard, you could say, but I just say hard because I played as him. He was fairly easy, fairly easy. But saying that, you do need to be good with all of his pinned accuracy, cutting everyone off, and all that. And they do start to pick up speed, so he could be super hard. But I'm just gonna say, ah, oh, yeah, hard in my opinion. All right, next next up is the Orani, the ring. I'm gonna put her in. Easy, not super easy. She's not that easy, but she's fairly easy, I'd say. <laughs> Even though I just said easy, um, she can teleport pretty fast. The uh, you know, um, what's it called? Where well, she can go like sort of invisible and all that. Very great, but also can be a bit hard, like manifesting and all that. No, no you could have a clear hit, but then they move, slam a pallet while you're manifesting. All right, next up is a pig. Pig. I don't think she, I mean, the ambushing does take skill. And then the trapping and making sure you don't run out of traps. But apart from that, you can just slug people, basically. So, I will say, oh, easy, yeah, because to getting her, oh, no, super easy after you've played, like, three games of her. You can just prounce on people, but at the same time, you know, she's got her crouch. You can get that fast. You can be insidious. That's pretty good. But she is a bit hard, but I'm just going to put her in easy. Next up, the plague. Oh, weird, weird one, a weird one. She just bleh on everyone. It's a bit crazy, but say medium, you know. Yeah, yeah, she's got her vomit. Yeah, you can go poisonous vomit, but you just like people can crouch under it. So medium, very, contra I think she, that would be very controversial, but he's a um, medium. Okay, Mikiel Myers. Okay, I did do a video. You know, his stalking is very easy, but at the same time, also hard. He's slow as tier one. Um, but he's an easy killer, you know. Very easy. He's just slow. So in that case, I'm putting him in medium. Medium, medium Myers. You know, you just need to be good. You just can't give away your location all the time. You want to be scary. Okay, the spirit. Every spirit, I just get murdered. I mean, she's not super hard to play with. She's not super easy. She's 
not medium, I'd say. I think, you know, you just need to get everything right with her. Just need Because you can easily trick people. I'd say hard, but also medium. I want to say medium, but it's just, no, I can't. I mean, when I've played with her, she's hard to play with. Okay, the trapper. Super easy, super good. Just put them down at pallets and all that. Just going to get stuck. Put them down near gens. Put them at hooks. It's perfect. Perfect. Oh, this motherfucker. Okay, this guy wants to make me DC. But where does he go? He goes easy. You know, his knife's bat, 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 bat. I know. You missed him. I know. Looks like he's back to face camping for you. But apart from that, you know, I've came across a few good ones, but then some of them just face camp. So I put them in super easy because his knives are decently easy to use. Just mow people down with those and his weapon. Yeah, he also has decent perks. All right, next up is the twins. Mm, I want to say hard to use, but the little crazy baby. I mean, I've not really played too much of her, but she's crazy. Uh, I would say hard. But super hard just calling my name. You know, you need to get good with her and then you also need to be close because it's just a matter of time until they get the baby off, kill it, and you've basically lost them. So I'd say super hard. Super hard, but once you get really good with him, like her, you can just like block, what are they called? Pallets, block, windows and all that. It's great, it's great. But apart from that, yeah. Okay, next up, the Wraith. Wraith. Moderately easy, like super easy uh, teleporting. And then bat, you could just use it to face and scare people so well. Super easy. I'm sorry, but super easy. I mean, yeah. Okay, next up is the Oni. I mean, do you know, you can follow the blood, but oh, it's just a head F. It's a head fuck. You know, especially when I've played a sim, I just got generosity destroyed. But I might have been versing two good players. <laughs> and is he super hard, though? No, he's hard. You know, I can't see him in medium. You know, his spirit free is decently hard to control, like the heal ability, like his speed. So, yeah. All right. Enough said. Hopefully, this is not as a controversial tier list. Uh, this is only in my opinion. So, with that said, I hope you guys all enjoy, and I'll see you guys next video. Bye.